Hello everyone, so this is a, a finale of how to put a foreign disk, but this is the gaming laptop, so I know it looks very new, but you can look there, yep, it's a, it lights up, it lights up green, because so, does, so did uh, my wallpaper, I just got it from the Google Images, <clears throat> uh, Google Images, excuse me. So, and then, I got a new disk drive, so this is uh, MTHS Tech, um, my mom just bought this at Amazon, as if, so it plays like Blu-rays, DVDs, and CDs, so, uh, so anyways, let's, let's begin how to put a four disk on the gaming laptop. So, let's start first. Prince of Persia on Xbox. Let's put my mouse up here. Sorry. Okay, so it reads uh VLC player. Oh, it reads so this is an Xbox game test. Please put on your Xbox to start playing. Hmm. Okay. Never done that on my my first laptop. Show on the video. All right. Eject the disc. Next up, Grand Theft Auto 3, um, Grand Theft Auto 4 on the Xbox 360. Alright, Grand Theft Auto 4. Oh, it boots up too. To play this disc, put it, put it in a Xbox 360 console. Okay, so I don't have a 360 at all. All I got is my Xbox One. And next up. Lego Star Wars, the Skywalker Saga, but it used to play on Xbox One and Xbox Series X, but I don't have a Series X just now. So. Okay, it's nothing. Well, it's nothing. It's nothing to read. Sorry, it's my bad. I have to close the door. All right, I'm back, everyone. So, let's take a slide quick. All right, 
So I don't have a PS4 right now, but it's it's already been uh, returned on the game store at Web for Texas. So excuse the location, but um, all I got is the PS3. Next up, Cabela's Dangerous Hunts 2011 for the PS3. Okay, still reading. And nope, it didn't read because it doesn't require like Blu ray game disc. So, let's head up to extras. So, um, let's start. <clears throat> Got a DVD. Star Wars Revenge of the Sith. Darth Vader. Sorry about that. Here it goes. It says BDRE Drive. Uh, Revenge of the Sith, Disc 1. Select to choose what happens when the enhanced DVD movies. Alright. <clears throat> Let's go in VLC Player. Well, I'm not going to show you no copyrights. Sorry. Star Wars. Oh, what the... Alright, DVD works. Showing, sorry, showing the Star Wars theme. Didn't mean to copyright it. So, <clears throat> excuse me for a second. Uh, next up, Blu ray. No time to die. But this is the latest James Bond movie ever made. Alright, this is No Time to Die. Um, so, I think it happens for Windows. It's for this disk drive, but you have to go and download a VLC player. It, it sits on the on the on the tools you can see there's a blu-ray on it let's go to VLC media player let's go to media and let me get close real quick the disk and right there it says Blu-ray. And hit play. So. <clears throat> Sorry about the message. Is Okay, no time to die. All right, so Blu-ray works. So yeah, Blu-ray works, and uh, <clears throat> oh, 
also replace DVDs. Yeah, I can see it on the case. Yeah, I just bought this at Walmart. A uh, Walmart, but it's the Walmart exclusive for uh, No Time to Die on Blu-ray. But it includes the uh, keychain, but it's in my keys. And next up, <clears throat> this is the legend. The 4K. Spider-Man No Way Home. So you can see the disc, it's Dr. Octavius. Okay, you can see the indicator was flashing. Let's check the VLC player. Disc. Uh, let's check the Blu-ray. Play. Nope. <clears throat> it didn't work. VLC kicked me out. VLC kicked me out. Darn it. And. We're gonna try fail off the game, but it includes a PC DVD ROM. Yeah, cause <clears throat> I just got this from uh, from last year of summer of 2021. I just got the laptop from online, so it didn't come with a disk drive, but. From over three days ago, I just got this uh, disc drive there, so I can watch movies on the go. All right. Okay, let's try it. So I don't know if it supports Windows 10 or something. Yeah, this is my operating system, Windows 10. Nice. So it does play with it. Alright. <clears throat> so I'm not going to download it because I don't want to get a kill the computer, but. So you can look over there. It says uh, Supporter Operating System from Windows XP and Windows Vista. Oh, no, 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 no. Windows Vista is the worst. Because I haven't tried a Windows Vista. I got the. <clears throat> Windows XP for a long ago, and uh, Windows 7 is my current uh, operating system, but I got, got a um, Windows 10 from last year. Alright, next up, CD, Leonard Skinner. Hold on. Sorry about that, my dad was just trying to ask me because he interrupted. So, go with Leonard Skinner on CD. Let's turn this way because the, the disc is getting dark. Okay, it says audio CD. Alright, so it plays like a, a VLC and a Windows Media Player. So that works. Alright. So let's. 
Now with the cartridges. So, close the disk drive. <clears throat> so, let's, I can see some slots over there. I can see a secret slot. So, I got a <clears throat> 3DS game. Sonic and All-Stars Racing Transformed. Oh, come on. Nope. It couldn't fit. <clears throat> so, yeah, Nintendo Switch. New Super Mario Brothers U Deluxe. So, there's a, there's a game card. Come on. That wouldn't fit either. Okay, that's that for the finale of how to put a foreign disc. So, <clears throat> thanks guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and leave the like and comments below. See you soon.